guys, okay, so, uh, sorry that my webcam is a little shitty, to, shitty right now, but, uh, so, I just want to go ahead and make this quick update video, it's nothing, sim nothing major, nothing simple, so, first of all, I had a lot of, I had a few questions on Twitter in regards to My Hero Academia Wants Justice on PS4, which, as a lot of you have already seen, and I stopped playing that. And the, the simple answer to that is, a lot of you know that in there are three different ways that I edit my videos. Let me go ahead and explain that. I have the laptop, which I'm using currently, which I'm still trying to get its webcam to focus. I think that's about as good as it's going to get, but um, anyway. So I also have a Surface Pro that I use for primarily editing and using for defining detail and stuff like that. And then I also have my PS4 which I use to record commentary for my videos via PS4 which I haven't done in a very good minute considering I broke my PS4's camera but I also got a new one last week so it should be fine on that. So other than that I kinda I wanna say I fell off of my Hero Academia strictly off the fact that it was I couldn't record anything on it. That's, and that's that's kind of a bit of a problem I've always had that I can never stream when I first streamed the stream the game like it never showed like it never showed any gameplay and then I uploaded that one online match I did with someone just to see if it actually would record it and it did but it didn't work like that so I couldn't record story the story mode I couldn't record the cutscenes or anything like that and as a lot of you who probably have the game have already noticed that you can't record a lot of people have already had this problem same as me so that right there like I said it's I mean yeah it's frustrating but I mean I'm not really complaining but hey frustrating as it is but we can still celebrate knowing that at least now I can still do much more videos yay but on to some real stuff so, I'm going to finish, I finished, as you guys have seen, I played the finale of The Walking Dead. Sad ending, sad to see it, sad to see that that series went bye-bye, but, you know, all good things must come to an end. And I learned that. And, but there is a bit of good news. I am starting to play The Division 2. I'm getting, I'm getting into that. I'm still, like, still doing videos for that. I'm still, like, like I said, it's a lot of videos that I'm going to be using and what is it else do I think I'm talking about? Um oh Awesome Con. So as I previously stated in one of my videos for Awesome Con, I will be wearing my Venom Lethal Protector yeah, who must say cosplay. Venom Lethal Protector T shirt. So and I've already gotten told by a few fans that they're gonna be at Awesome Con as well. So, you know, feel free to stop by, we can chop it up. You know, feel free to it because, like I said, I will be on YouTube live live streaming and recording all three day events. And just a heads up, I cannot record any of the video, any video at all when it comes to meeting my celebrities. Otherwise, they will kick me out. And I honestly am not trying to lose seventy dollars for a three day event, knowing I can't do any of that and then get kicked out. It's it's honestly not worth it. So I'd rather not terrorize or endanger myself by doing such a thing because Awesome Con has been going through a lot of changes over the course of the last few years and personally like it, it's it, it's just not worth it. It's it's really not. <sighs> Coke. Good another Coke. But another good another set of good news is um, I'll be, I think it'll probably take at least another seven to ten more walkthroughs for Sword Art Online Fatal Bullet until I finish with that. As I said previously in a lot of my commentaries with Sword Art Online, that I was only going to only going to play that game up until level sixty, and I kind of fell off of it pretty much. But I'm getting back into it though. It's no big deal. And last but finally not least. Finally got Saikiro. So yeah. 
finally got Shadow's Die twice, and I got the Collector's Edition, which came with the letter opener katana from Wolf. So I will be probably playing that, and at the time of this video being uploaded, it probably will come up about sometime later, as well as a few more videos that I have in store. I've got a lot more videos in store, and like I said, I've finished a lot of my games so far. So I think probably during the summer, I'm going to probably lean off of playing video games and focus more on the commentary setup of it all. Because like I said, I primarily play Fortnite and Apex Legends these days. So even though I recently only uploaded one video for Apex, I'm going to actually get back into playing Apex. After Season 8 for Fortnite is over, after that ends, then I should be fine. But as I digress, I appreciate you guys, and like I said, uh, there's plenty more commentary that I have in, in store. I have a lot more, you know, comics, movies, and stuff like that to talk about. And I, like I said, I've written, I won't say I wrote scripts for it because I don't do scripts. It's not a thing. But I will say one thing. What I have written down are the videos that I want to do and who, if not, whether or not I should do a collaboration with the two. So, like I said, feel free to continue watching my channel, you know, subscribe, shout me out, do whatever. And after that, we can, you know, Awesome Con is ain't but two weeks away. We got, got some time to share with one another. So I would, I would greatly appreciate those of you who are a fan of the channel. If you are, in fact, a fan of the channel, you support what I do, by all means, stop through. I'll be there. And I will be there on three days. <clears throat> Ooh, excuse me. But, you know, appreciate you guys.